Where is your advice to inspiring entrepreneurs? Don't give up. I know sometimes people say that oh, I have a plan A, have a plan B, have a plan C, all these things but don't work. And I believe those plan Bs and plan Cs are just a cop out. Yes, we need to learn to, what people say, pivot. We need to learn how to do certain things. But if you really are passionate about what you're doing, and then second of all, is it going to make a difference in individuals' lives? Go for it. If you can make a difference and do something, try it. I'm not telling everybody that they need to go out here and quit their jobs and go start to be the next big, large Amazon or Facebook or whatever it is, but you can do whatever you can do in your space. If it's just a side hustle, you know, do something on a weekends, do something at night, generate some additional income and do what you have to do or make a difference in people's lives. But being an entrepreneur, it's not for the faint of heart. It's not going to be easy. People think that, okay, now I can be an entrepreneur. I can just sit back in this land of beach. Now you're probably going to work more hours than you did in your regular job. It's a lot of stuff that needs to be happen. You know, there's a lot of the business side. You have the IRS, you know, you have 941s, you got payroll taxes, you got staff you have to take care of. There's a lot of things that goes along with it, but I wouldn't change anything from the world. And I encourage you, if you want to become that entrepreneur, do your research, get yourself a good mentor, and just make sure that you're in a great market and to fulfill your services. Don't go in a space that's really crowded. Just maybe find your niche market and just find something and just go after it. And I just wish you continued success and future success for anything that you might want to do.